In this video, we're going to take a look at how to use manual line breaks, sometimes called soft carriage returns. Normally when you're doing typing, you type to the end of the line, and when you get to the end of the line, you keep typing, and the computer wraps that text around onto the next line. Then when you get to the end of your paragraph, you press the paragraph key and the computer jumps down onto the next line for you. So we'll just switch on the show hide. We can see the line has wrapped around here. We get to the end of the first paragraph, press the enter key and we get the paragraph mark and the text jumps down to the next line. That's all very well and works in most cases. Now I've had a bit of a dilemma. Um, I'm trying to follow the syllabus in the exact um, way it is written. But really this part of soft carriage returns or manual line breaks would actually come a better a little bit later on when you're a bit more familiar with um, how to work with various aspects of paragraphs. So if all of this doesn't make perfect sense, don't worry. Watch the next two or three videos about paragraph uh, alignments, for example, paragraph shading, styles, and then come back to this video and I think it'll make a little bit more sense. Some kinds of formatting, the ones I've just mentioned, work on a paragraph. Styles work on a paragraph. Alignments work on a paragraph. Other types work just on the text. For example, I can highlight some text and change the colour. That's working on the characters, not working on the paragraphs. That's the bit that you haven't yet done. I've got a paragraph of text here with a specific style on it. It's called Heading 1. And again, watch a later video to know what that means. But it's got a Heading 1 style on it. Now, when I get to the end of the text, if I want to start a new line and press the enter key you can see when i type the text does not maintain the same formatting as the previous paragraph that's because that formatting is applied to the paragraph not the text itself now then just undo that sometimes you might want that formatting to continue onto the next line so instead of pressing the enter key to get a new paragraph, we can press shift and enter, because what that does is gives us a manual line break or a soft carriage return. Let's try it. I'm holding down the shift key. I press and release the enter key, and then I release the shift key. Now you can see, if I switch off show hide, the effect is just the same um, as pressing the enter key. The cursor insertion point has jumped down to the next line. Switching show hide back on. I haven't got a paragraph mark there. I've actually got a soft carriage return mark. So what is the difference? Well, the difference is that I'm still in that same paragraph. So when I type now, the formatting has been maintained. You can see the paragraph mark is here. So all that text has the same formatting in it. And I can do that as many times as I want. I can press Shift and Enter to get a soft carriage turn and keep typing. Shift and Enter to get a carriage turn, keep typing. And it maintains that formatting. But as soon as I press the Enter key to get a new paragraph now, the formatting reverts. So that's what a manual line break or a soft carriage return does, it starts a new line within the current paragraph. It allows you to start a new line of text within the current paragraph. Now the uses for that are beneficial in when you're using bulleted numbered lists that you haven't yet done, in styles that you haven't yet done, in borders and shading that you haven't yet done. Think about this soft carriage return when you look at those videos and have a little bit of a play around and you'll start to begin the begin to understand the power of using that 
manual line break. But for this part of the syllabus, all you need to know is how to insert it, shift and enter, and how to remove it. And you remove it like any other character. You just use backspace or the delete key to get rid of it. And that merges those lines together. We can get rid of that one, just use the delete key, and it's gone. And it merges the text together. So that's soft carry returns or manual line break. We insert it using press by pressing the shift and enter key instead of just the enter key. And we can remove it just by deleting in the normal way.